Okay, it's martini time. I'm gonna show you how we make a vodka dirty martini with blue cheese stuffed olives. So first, I need to get the olives ready. So what I'll do is take those, take the pimentos out, and I eat them because they're good wood. Gotta have three olives per martini. Otherwise, it's bad luck. You see those single olive martinis? Double. Those are bad luck. You have to have three olives to have good luck. Okay, next is this amazing gadget. It's called an olive stuffer. Or a, basically, it's a tube. It has a piston that drives down through it. And you load the tube up by just pressing it into some blue cheese crumbles. Gorgonzola is great. I'm just using a generic blue cheese from the grocery store. And then you put it right over the top and push it in. So now you have a stuffed olive. You wanna get all three of those done for each glass. Great. If there's a little on the outside, that's fine. It goes great inside the martini. And now that we have those done, I'm gonna put them on my little skewers here. That's set towards the bottom. I'll set those aside so I don't knock them over. And next, I need to get some ice in here. And I fill that up about halfway with uh, ice cubes. And then I need to, oh, this is gonna be a dirty martini, so we have to add olive juice. The more olive juice you add, the dirtier it is. That's to your own taste. Now I'm gonna use my favorite vodka, Kettle One, which is a Dutch vodka. To do two martinis, I'll fill this up once, twice, three times, about half of a, another one. Put that on and shake it. You shake it long enough to your hands start, your fingers start to hurt from the cold. I spin it and let it wobble. And the reason I do that is so that the vodka sitting on top can go back inside those holes. And we just pour it. And that's it. Dirty martinis with vodka and blue cheese stuffed 
olives. Delicious. Hope you enjoyed. Please subscribe and we'll see you in the next video.